So I've got a CSV on my desktop. Um, I want to get that into R to analyze it. It's quite easy. Uh, normally I just create a new uh, folder to put all my files and uh, stuff in. So let's just call this example. Copy that into there. And then I use R Studio. Um, so I'll just create a new, well I've got a new, uh, a new uh, R script here, but you want to go to press the little plus sign, press R script for a new one. And then I set the workspace uh, to that directory we just created. Uh, so you might need to refresh this. And then there's example. So now we're in that directory with the CSV file. Um, and then I go to session, set working directory to files pane location. Uh, and that's the same as writing this command, but it sets your, work, sets your working directory to, to here. And then to read in the CSV is quite easy. Uh, just the name of the data frame you want to create first. So online comments uh, and a little arrow, and then just read dot CSV and then in brackets and in quotes the name of this. So comments dot CSV, and that's it. Um, now I've purposely picked a CSV that'll break here. So if I try, uh, let's just save this as read CSV. If I press run, which will just run this one line, uh, and then try to view this, it, it's all it, it's all broken. It doesn't work. Um, and so if that happens to you, just check the CSV in. Um, the text editor uh, so let's just check this in, in the text editor and you can see here that the delimiter between all the the data in your CSV is a semicolon uh, it might be different for you and if that's the case just go back to your script change that to sep equals and then you delimiter. And now if you try that, oh, you need a comma as well. You should uh, be able to see your data frame. Easy.